Hi everybody, I'm going to show you the model checker tool. So the model checker tool is a Revit tool that is used for checking the Revit model before it goes to takeoff, as well as checking the model uh, periodically throughout the project. So to open the tool, you're going to need to find it and click the model checker button. When you do, this dockable pane will pop up. The first thing you want to do is click this expander button that says model checklist. And when you do, this checklist will pop up. Now this checklist is a list of all the steps you need to do to complete the model check. Um, so in step one, for example, step one is check takeoff components. You use the takeoff components tool and in this description column, it explains the steps you need to do to complete this step. If you double click on this row, it'll open up this tab down here. and It'll take you to the place you need to go to complete the step. Uh, the same thing goes for any other rows. Like if you click it, it'll open up that tab. Uh, similarly, you could just, you know, click down here to open up the tabs. But this is like a little shortcut. Now, after you've done your step, you're going to want to go over to the left-hand side under the checked and initial columns, and you're going to want to click this checkbox and put in your initials. And this date is going to update to the time that you did that step. When anyone else working on the same job opens up this checklist, since this data is being stored on our SQL server, they're going to know who checked it and what time, um, and they'll be able to coordinate accordingly. So that's just a basic rundown of how this checklist section works. And later in this video, I'm going to explain each of these individual steps.